Right, Steve, are you going to show me your homemade uh, um, bite indicator for the yeah. bottle feeder? Yeah, sure. Uh, basically, uh, I'll start up at the top end. We've got the elastic in the pole tip. Uh, it's quite a heavy, uh, hollow elastic. Um, rated 10 and upwards, really, for this type of fishing. Yep. You're liable to catch barbel and bream. Um, barbel up to £10 plus, bream £6. You need something really strong, basically. Um, We've got a nice big elastic connector, yeah, uh, the old like old fashioned type, um, basically because I've got to try and get both loops, one from the indicator elastic and the, the absorber elastic and the mainline loop onto this. Yeah, this is a piece you've actually made yourself, isn't it? It's basically a piece of elastic with a, a loop on the end, so that goes into your stompho along with the, uh, the rig. But then, uh, what elastic is this? What, what number? So this is like five solid elastic, number five, number high five vis. solid, yeah. And this is going down into a piece of, uh, it's basically an old crystal waggler that I've yep. cut off. And uh, basically I've drilled out the top end, enough, a big enough hole to, so the elastic can be threaded through, thread it through and tie a double knot on the bottom, yep. pull that double knot back up so it can't pull back through that hole. This is basically my in, my bite indicator on the end of the pole. Yeah, so, so you've also got three bits of silicone there holding holding your rig. That's right. Yeah, yeah. basically three pieces of silicone, which I can thread the main line of the main rig through. Yeah. Tie a loop on the end of the line and also connect it to the Stompho connector. Yeah. What needs to be done then is to create a, a piece of slack line basically pull yeah. four to six inches of extra line through the silicone rubbers that allows when the pole rigs in place when you're fishing it and it's like this in the water yeah you're going to get a bite it's going to stretch the elastic it's going to stretch the elastic and in and pull that indicator down yeah but basically course, like this but of course you're playing the fish still on the rig because it's not just the rig attached to the end of the elastic, the rig is also attached there. So once you've bottomed that elastic out, you're playing it on the main you're line. Playing then. the fish on the rig. So yeah, it's really clever. So let's run that through that again. We've got the elastic in the stompho with the indicator, and the rig is also connected to the stompho there and pinned to the indicator with these three bits of silicon. And then yep. a little bit of slack line. And that's your bite indicator. That's it. Really brilliant homemade uh, bit of kit. Right, let's go catch some fish.